ladies and gentlemen, boom, fellas. The Shadur Sanders experience. Hey, 3,000 likes, you guys have another one. I want to get back to daily, so kill the like button. Oh, I'm not going to leave any spoilers, but there there may be a uh, potential trade in this video. I'm not leaving any spoilers. I'm just saying there could be. You might be seeing, where's my water? A potential trade. Guys, how are you guys doing? Are you excited for Christmas? If you guys have, this is my comment. If you guys have watched every episode, I'm always so curious. Comment just every episode. Let me know when you, or comment when you started watching because I believe that there are people out here who have watched all of them. Shout out to you guys, man. This has been, we're almost 40 episodes in here and we're playing good football. I love this team. CJ Henderson gets an upgrade. The last three games, Shadur Sanders has been absolutely money. And that is, that's been our biggest change in this entire thing. We started off horrible and slowly his stats are correcting. Trey Tucker is going crazy. I switched Travis Hunter to be just defense, which I think honestly was a really good move. Even though his stats don't reflect that, um, he's been locked down out there. And last game, if you watch, he was he was locked down. Uh, I'm open to if people want me to bring him back or do whatever. But as of right now, I feel pretty comfortable in that decision that I made. And I don't think I want to do anything differently. Here's the predicament. I think as of right now, I'm not going to sign Colton Miller. It's a tough call. I don't know. I feel like I can do better in the draft and save. Like, I have a lot of money, which is the thing that makes me want it. It's just, there's also a lot of people that are going to need to be paid. Like, with us being, getting so good so quickly, it's going to result in a lot of people needing money. The Chargers are struggling, which is so good to see. Um, this is this guy's a good player. He knows what he's doing. This is going to be a big-time game. Um, 8.20 p.m. under the lights. Kind of one of these games that we're currently leading the division. These guys are selling. The Chiefs, Chargers, like if I could get the Chargers to 3-5, and five, mentally he would be so defeated. Hopefully we don't even have to see him in the playoffs. Guys, week 9. Let's go. On first down, it's Herbert. He finds his man. Touch grass, dude. Good throw, though. Good tackle from Hunter. I'm curious if that's his scheme, if he's going to go five wide. There we go, Hunter. Good job, Travis. Good stuff by Travis Hunter right there. That's he, Look, he made that play. Got off his block. They tried to block him. He did a great job. Yep, got him. Down. And that's the 25. Good job. Okay, like I said, we're just gonna start off this game trying to make the simplest, easiest throws that we, we can possibly do. Because I don't know if his offense is that great. His defense is good. I do have trouble at times against his defense. His defense is definitely good. But oh, okay. They'll drop to throw. He'll buy some time right. Got him. They'll stick with the passing. Cameron Givens. There it is. Good job. Go! Go, Givens! Go, Givens! One block for me one time! We haven't forgotten about you, Cameron. 1400. Are you guys team Cameron Givens or Trey Tucker? Who's your favorite? Comment it down below. I love you. Let's go. Seven up. Cameron's just last season was so dominant and made so many wild plays. He has a special place in my heart. But on the other hand, I feel the same about Trey Tucker. Trey Tucker has been here the whole time. He's a he's a true Raider. He wasn't drafted. He's literally just been here the entire time. So that that's what makes him interesting. Good job, D line. Justin Herbert looking to throw on second down. There's a short one to the tight end Johnson. Running on first down. Good play. Here's Herbert. There's a short one to the tight end. That's question, isn't it? If I knew this wouldn't be so difficult. Snuggy, nobody move. Go! Jobo, man! Oh, you don't realize the Jobo, but you just missed a massive opportunity, David. A Jobo. Got him. Akuda. Picks. Why would I pick that? You might ask. I did not mean to, but that was it still ended up working out really good for us. 
Great defense, good stuff. Let's go. He's got one on one over there on Cameron Gibbons. We have an opportunity this drive to really go. Oh, no. Mom! I just hit a clip. No. Who's Lowell? Who the heck is Lowell? That was gross. That was absolutely freaking stupid. Flex on him, Jacob. Flex on him, kid. That's never horrible defense when someone feels the need to like scramble. Here's Herbert. It's immediate. He's just immediately rushing. I don't know why he's doing that. It's like he snaps. It's working, but I don't know how he knows to do it. Look at Steven. Steven's just. I love it. Steven's just pointed at the scoreboard. I'm almost certain that's what Steven's just did. On first down, Justin Herbert escaping the pressure right. They'll try the air now with Herbert. Oh my! No! That needs to be. That's that's you get benched the next play. That's a hundred percent you get benched the next play if you make a play like that. That when opportunity knocks, you gotta take advantage. An opportunity just knocks. Someone there. There's somebody there. He's third down, so I'm not going to really bother with timeouts here. I feel like he's going to pass this. He is going to try and clock us. No shock there whatsoever. They're going to spy up for a reason. Oh, guys. Way, 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 way too much time right there. Dang it. Okay, we get ball at half. If I can put together a good, like, minute and 15 drive and then a good drive after half, we could potentially go up two scores, go plus 14. But that was a situation where I really... Mm, I felt like that drive, he didn't do anything great. He literally just threw, like, tiny check downs. Uh, and, and ran the ball with his quarterback. Like, I wasn't, like, wowed there. So hopefully next drive I can bank on getting a stop. Ideally. Well, partner, you know, coaches always say that every play is designed to score a touchdown. Sometimes that's not really true. Yeah. It's to happen. Incredible when they do. And you saw the celebration. Okay, time out. 43 seconds. Second and two. This is caught by Tucker. Yeah, use the second one. That's a, that's a good throw. Little bit sketchy, but Tucker's going to make that play for us every single time. Back to throw again. Trying to get it to Williams, but it's intercepted. Got to be a joke. Mike freaking win. Wow, look at this throw. Mike like, just bullied. Oh, no. That was a great opportunity that we just had that we completely just wasted. Like, he now has three timeouts to potentially score four out. I can't put into words how bad situationally that just was. And then you allow that. If he's not making reads right now, he's just throwing easy stuff. Out of the gun, Eckler running it. If they hurry, we'll see. Eckler going to get it again on second down. And a very determined run there. Yeah, he's just going to take three, which is... Which still sucks. That's a free three points. We get ball at half, but... Totally negates the stop that we got. Okay, stick to the ground game. Be smart. We we need something after half here. Man, oh man, how on earth did that ball end up where it ended up? In that first half, we saw a fair amount of offense on both sides of the football, and now the team trailing here will start with it in the third quarter. They'll look to throw here. That's a good throw. Same as last time. Like both those were just, both those really, really, really good throws. Like I'm not worried 
I'm worried about myself losing this game. Less him like doing something to show me that he's gonna win. I'm more worried about myself selling and just continuing to throw dumb interceptions. That that's how I lose this game. He's not gonna necessarily like crazy out adjust me or anything. Like we can run, we can pass. I feel like we can really do whatever we want right now. But just I can't make any dumb mistakes. Because his offense isn't great, but it's also not horrible. Now they'll switch it up here and look to throw. And it's a fumble. Literally what I said, precisely what I said, yeah, like he's not going to do anything to win this game, I'm just going to do stuff to lose this game. Oh my gosh. Just stupid, man. What am I doing out here? On first and ten, Herbert. Back to throw here, Herbert. Okay, scared money, third and six. Gonna throw on third down with Herbert. He'll go up top here for Hamler. And that's caught at the 25. Total sell right now. Okay, I, I still got time in this game to do something. Still do. Can't get over. I just... Bad decisions. Like, fumble, interception. Take a game that you clearly were in control of and totally flip that on its head. They'll elect to bring it out here from the end zone. Yeah. The coach is walking that line of being calm and really being firm with this team. Had one tell me once, you know, we were having a tough patch. This two Good job, man. Two Good job, man. Like, all I can do is get to the 30. And then at the 30, it's just like, oh, let's, let's do something really stupid. Even though he has not shown at all that he can stop us. Let's just give him... I let him just do that. Set up to throw. A short throw, and that's hauled in by Mo. Again, he'll drop to throw. He's yep. Got... They'll look to throw again. 17 yards to go on second down. This is Gibbons. Nice oh, catch, Cameron. Four is up, baby. Minimum, I'll get three here, and I'm gonna give. I gotta give my defense a chance. No, no matter what, that's important. That I, it, at minimum, I'm gonna give my defense some hope of having a chance in this game. There we go, Michael Mass. Good stuff. Come on, Givens. I just gotta try and I need tempo. I gotta hurry this up and try and just get a touchdown. Every second that goes on off this clock, we're not getting back at the end of the game. So. Oh, come on, defense! Let's go! Let's go! Let's go! Let's go! Let's go! He's far from a brain surgeon out here. Like he's far from it. Find a freaking way, Brett. Find a way. One stop. advantage in a one score game and you hear a lot about two minute offensive four minute offense obviously the three of them but it has to be plays that gets first downs and keeps the ball away from him on first down it's Herbert they'll get this out wide to F five you're just trying to get four on first down they're headed to the guys oh I overran him I can't say guys that's just me Herbert takes it and just best play of the day Brett best play of the day by far one good thing about trying to defend that play, you should see it coming the whole way. You see, five points of contact necessary at this stage. He's gonna get it again. Just looking to get forward and protect the ball. Now the best case is like 20 seconds to have the ball. I think I think he's gonna run all three times. Here. Five yards on third down. Throw it. Just throw it. Oh, he tried to. Okay, we caught him a little bit. I, had that been like a throwaway, had he attempted something, we definitely are laughing right now, but at the end of the day, we're going to have about 20 seconds, all told, to go down the field. I don't even think he'd be kicking this right now. He's going to 
be laying. The uh, Chargers yeah. here. And this will split the upright. Okay, 20 seconds, full field, no timeout. He'll look to throw. Flush to his right. Back to throw. The way I look at this game is just total missed opportunities to had a had a chance before half to really take advantage of the game. I step up, I see him right here. Are you guys not throwing this ball? I see him right here, and Mike Williams, like that's somehow an interception. And then after half, we fumble. Like both situations that we had to kind of take the game, both bad things happen, and just that's just the way she goes. You're not gonna win games playing like this. It's not a good look for us. I thought our offense moved fine. Our run game was really cool. Our defense wasn't horrible. Like, at the end of the day, 100% of self-inflicted loss. I lost that game because I lost that game. I lost that game because, truthfully, I just messed up. So, at the end of the day, I can live with that. But it sucks because that guy is not good at the game. And I shouldn't be losing to him. But it is what it is. We get the Packers next week, which is also going to be tough. The division just continues to get more exciting. Okay, I have the trade talks I gotta talk about, but I'm, I need a minute, I'm just too upset. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, you ready for some trade deadline mania? Five and four, we're about, we're about to just start cold calling people in the league. Start with the Lions. I don't think I've ever even talked to this guy on the phone. What's up, man? You, what, you're sick? Yeah. Oh, that's no good. Oh, no worries. I hope you feel better. Appreciate it, man. H has it helped your Madden skills or hurt them? Well, I mean, I'm still the defending champion, so... Yeah. Think... Did Have you yeah. won this thing twice? Yeah, back to back. Okay, what are you trying to do then? Let's talk trade deadline. What? Let me help you. I'm not here to help myself. I've, I've already done that. I am... I am selfless and I am kind and I want I want something that's going to benefit both of us. Okay. Who are you moving? Well, at the moment, uh, let me see. See, at the moment, I'm good. On, I'm good offense. I would like a wide receiver, honestly, because I can't really. Darnell Mooney is just you know Darnell Mooney, not it. You don't like Mooney. Not really. The Step into the speed. office, dude. Step into the office. The 93 speed is all right, but, I mean, I ain't going to lie. I don't really have that, like... The go-to. Yeah. Like the Mike that. Williams, for example. You don't have no. that. No, 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 no. I ain't no... I'm not a jump ball type of person. So you're missing the Michael Norton. Like, someone like Michael Norton that you could use. More like a sure hands type of guy. Like a check down type of guy that I can go to. Oh, with. Chosen Anderson. Oh, you trying to give me an old dude. No, I'm not. Okay, but if let's if if you're willing to get rid of Mooney, I am a Mooney <laughs> fan. Okay? Mooney okay. Mooney can play here. I love Darnell Mooney. So let's just put him on the table. What do I gotta do to get Mooney? Okay, let's see. How much? Me. How much did you pay him? Because I'm a I'm a Mooney guy through and through. You're not even playing him this year. That just makes me sad. Mooney, Mooney isn't Mooney isn't like he. I'm telling you. Well, honestly, he thinks million. offensively, bro. I just can't get on the ball. Okay, well then step into my office. Let's make a deal. All right, let me load up. Let me help see. you. See, as of right now. The only people that you, I mean, you're your own, so you see who touched the ball. Yeah, no, I can see. You got no leverage now. I got all your leverage. But I, I, mean, I can help you out at DB. I got Kader Kahu. He's not playing for me. He's a star dev. He's good. Kader Kahu? <laughs> I got picks. I would potentially move a pick for Darnell Money Man Mooney. I'm a fan. For like a second, third? What are you Chill. About? Let's, what about. What about, I feel like fourth. With that contract, I feel like a fourth. I'm oh. taking on 14 million a year for a 93 speed receiver. A oh, fourth, now you sell them now? Because who would I, who, who then would I use? Okay, or we could do this. Well, honestly, I think I got a replacement receiver for him. 
Do you, do you want do you want Mike Williams? Mike Williams and Cameron Givens aren't in the same. We're we're not on the same wavelengths right now. That's the thing. I got too many six four receivers. I need I need a Mooney. Who's Quan Overton? I don't know, but he's kind of nice. Yeah, six one two oh nine ninety one speed, Ricky. Yeah, yeah. Okay, no, let's, let's let's put Quan Overton in there. Then I love Quan Overton. Yeah, yeah. Let's put let's put Quan in there. I'll trade, even though he's star, he's normal dev. That's fine. He's a stud. And you would get Mooney, which is fine. I'm okay with shipping Mooney because I got two rookies on the bench. Okay, I got a. Ooh, okay, we cat. doing that straight up. <laughs> Let me do. Let's do. Let's do Quan in the fourth. Quan in the fifth. A fifth. A fifth. Uh, you know. Wait. Wait. How long? How how many seasons we doing? A hundred. Tell. I, until you get to the promised land, of course, of course. Shut up. <laughs> of course. So, all right. Let yeah. Let's do it. Quan over ten in the fifth for Darnell Mooney. I'll take that. I, and I'm taking the fourteen million in cap on. Right. I'm helping I'll, you. Deal. You're the two-time champ. I hate seeing Mooney over there just sad. Yeah, he all hit I mean he getting rings, but no production value. Yeah, no, it doesn't matter if you're getting rings if you're not playing. I sent the trade, by the way, because I need that kind of receiver. I can make Mooney into a beast. And then we'll just meet in the Super Bowl. Alright, that, that's hey, done deal. Done deal. Did you did you accept? Right, accepted. Dude, that was a pleasure. Pleasure doing business with your brother. That was a pleasure. Because I, I have the money. I got the $14 million. Mooney's going to play. Mooney's going to step right in and play. He's a Bears legend, and you're just giving him no respect. I appreciate doing the deal. No problem, man. Thank you. Okay, good I stuff. Love, have a good night. Eat. Feel better. Appreciate it, man. Feel better. Okay, peace. Guys, I love that trade. That was a good freaking trade. We uh, went to the two-time champ. I To me, Mooney is... Everything I look for in a receiver. He is star development. So a couple good games could go to Superstar. And if he goes to Superstar, he's going to get good abilities. I want Mooney's career resurrected on this team. I think that was a win. I think that was a great trade. I love it. I love it. I love it. Love it. Freaking love it. Good stuff. He can fit in with Tucker, Cameron Givens, and Mooney. Because Mike Williams isn't really working out. In the last game, he really annoyed me. I, need, I, I want Mooney, Tucker, and Givens working together. Guys, hey... 3,000 likes. We'll see you all tomorrow.